Hello, I'm Tom Burke, pastor at United Church of Sandwich with Pam, our financial uh, chairperson. Um, we wanted to take a few minutes to give you an update on the financial status of United Church of Sandwich as we enter the second half of 2021. Before we talk about 2021, Pam, can you give us a very brief recap of how 2020 went? Yeah, uh, we started out 2020 as we normally do with a fairly good size uh, deficit. But in March, of course, COVID hit and, and that changed everything. Uh, basically, in 2020, our giving stayed strong. And, and that is a real, de uh, a real uh, plus to our church. Um, a couple things happened. Uh, one, the expenses dropped because we were no longer in worship inside the church, so utilities were not being spent, and our payroll expenses dropped. We also had no fare, so that which is the biggest uh, fundraiser that this church has and has had for many years. But we had um, two real big infusions of uh, income into our church. The first one being a PPP grant that we received from the federal government. Also, we received a $35,000 uh, gift from a nonprofit organization uh, With the thirty-five thousand uh, dollar gift from the nonprofit, uh, that came from a uh, a nonprofit connected to a church member in our church uh, for future uh, uh, mission and ministry opportunities for our church. So, so basically, in in twenty twenty, we remained uh, financially stable uh, when uh, a lot of other churches were not as fortunate as as we were. Uh, and the infusion of, of these uh, two uh, amounts of money allowed us uh, the opportunity to have time to uh, come up with ideas that we could uh, do, such as uh, a fair food fest, a pork chop barbecue, the pie of the month, various things like that, that we were able to do um, to bring in more revenue for our church which also allowed us to do some things that this church has not been able to do for some time to come, which is more of an outreach to our community through free hot dog lunches, free um, chili giveaway. Uh, we also uh, put in time giving fr uh, free meals to members of our congregation, not because they needed it, but the big, that's because we wanted to do it. Um, and we have very generous individuals in this church who are willing to put up uh, some of their own money, so a lot of this did not come out of the church's budget by any means. So as an overall recap of 2020, the main uh, uh, item we want you to understand is in the moment in the year of the highest uncertainty in this church's history, in this country's uh, uh, recent history, our church remain financially stable and even with the loss of the sandwich fare because of the special giving we were able to continue to operate not in an attitude of fear or crisis but in a attitude of faith and allowed us to grow and expand ministries to live out our mission statement of our church and so that took us into uh, January of 2021 as we were still deep in the midst of the pandemic, but with the expectation and faith that we would be coming out of the pandemic this year. And so how do we look for the first half and technically the first five months of 2021? Well, we look like we're, we're doing very well. Um, our, once again, our congregation is, is exceeding uh, our budgeted amount for uh, offerings. Um, because of our various fundraisers uh, in, uh, that we've been having, uh, our other income has, has uh, gone up greatly. Now our exp expenses are right on uh, basically target for um, 
this time of the year, but we do have to uh, be reminded that uh, we will be going into a, a time period, the summer and into the winter, where now that we are back into worship, we will have uh, more expenses, more expenses with uh, payroll and with utilities. So we need to continue to do our due diligence. We can't let up uh, and, and just figure that everything is going to go well. We, we never know when uh, something with COVID or the world is, is going to affect us again. We have, with our uh, income through offerings of pledged and non-pledged giving over this first half of the year, uh, meeting uh, ex even slightly exceeding our expectations of, bu of our budget, and with our expenses uh, coming in at about what our budget was, we enter the second half of 2021 in a financially stable position ahead of where many faith communities are. And we have the ability to celebrate in faith our financial health. But we also need to understand that we are continuing in the most uncertain time for our church. And so we must not let our guard down for the care of our finances as we continue to move forward. We are in a strong place but that only allows us to take these next few steps in strength, but also needing the wisdom and guidance of God in our financial stewardship. If there are any questions that you have about uh, our budget, about our income or expenses, please reach out to see me and I can connect you to Pam or another member of the financial uh, finance committee so that we may answer those questions. We are here together as a community because of God's love for us and because of your love for each other. Let's continue to move forward with the same faith and the same strength that you have shown for the last 15 months. Thank you and have a wonderful day.